we're gonna get horrible, horrible, horrible win rate. And the world record is like not high enough where it's warranted to do that. But warranted to do that. We actually have a really, really good time here in individual boards. On the first die roll, we can't use Warrior Die, because if we do, well, things are gonna get messy, and we're actually not getting a star spawn. We don't take that. That's slightly worse than the other star spawn. And with war is super worse because we are gonna grab the first star. We are gonna aim to be the first one to grab a star. But we are gonna want to wait as long as possible to do so. The reason why I play war is because warrior has a heat die. Warrior's die is, die is like the heatiest die in the game. It's the most unfair die. It's a die that guarantees that I, roll, that I roll a 6, or I don't move at all, so I will always move 6. I will always move 6 spaces. I will always, always move 6 spaces. When I move. It's like a super cheaty die. As long as we don't roll 6 on the first die, we can continue this run, and we are really favored to win. Or a 1. Don't want to roll one either. Okay, two. Perfect. That's the perfect roll. Because now we can guarantee to get an ally soon. And that way we can secure many bonus stars. The good thing with Wario is that Wario is like almost certain to get the movement star. Because Wario's die aver has averages rolling 4 while everyone else's die averages rolling 3. And a half. So on average I'm gonna move 5 spaces more than everyone else. The nasty part though is how I move. When I like know how I will move, like that makes a huge difference. It makes a huge, huge, huge difference knowing how I will move. Like, yeah. I'm sadly part of the team, which is not good. We should have won that. <laughs> there we go. The problem with War is that I'm gonna need a lot of coins to make use of him, so I want to win a lot of minigames. And I want fast minigames because I am gonna lose time on board movement compared to when I play as Rosalina. Because War is like the slowest character, but War is like. I have routed every single board to work with Warrior right now, so yeah, I'm feeling pretty secure. Pretty safe and secure. Yeah, I can use my own die. Oop. Minus two, that's the worst roll, but it's fine. That means I don't move. I don't know, I feel very favored still, even though I rolled a uh, minus two there. I feel very favored still. It's obvious not good I rolled that. I would have preferred to roll six and start moving, but like, I'm fine.
Yoshi's a threat here though. Okay, good. Yoshi's no longer a threat. I would have pref like I would prefer to roll a little bit higher because I really need the movement because I need to secure the bonus stars. Because we are still playing a bonus we are still playing on winning the bonus stars for those things. The good thing is that everyone is in Yale, but every but people are gonna leave Yale soon. And then Yale people can get allies, and I want to be the only one with allies. Oh no, this mini game I can't win. The AI is gonna be fantastic on this mini game, I can promise you all that much. You will see some godly play from the AI here. Start. The AI took like a PhD in physics. In Mario Party physics specifically, because Mario Party physics works differently from real life physics. Yeah, the, I, I said I would lose. Winner. The AI is really good at this minigame on this difficult level. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, the AI took like PhDs in physics. Yeah, some minigame. Like, I hate that minigame because like if I get like one green left, it's like on the edge. It's like really hard to finish. I'm also really bad at minigame because it requires like motorics. Yeah, I hate the green candy. Oh, of course I keep rolling zeros, minus two coins. That's like the one thing I don't want to happen. Don't like, don't feel worried though. This is like the board I am counting on losing on a lot. Because this board is hard. This board is probably the hardest board. Every board is hard if I roll as I have done, but yeah. The best thing now is that I don't have coin or minigame star, and I only have slowpoke stars, the only star I currently have, but I hope to change that. I have less coin than it looks like I have though. Oh no, Hamble's going back, yeah this is not good. I need to start rolling sixes, otherwise we're in trouble. Okay, this one is good, but it's gonna be hard to win. The time situation right now is amazing, I should add. Time situation is amazing. We're not gonna beat the IL record for this, I don't think. The IL record for this one is really, really strong. Like, extremely strong. I have a really, really strong IL time here. I think I'm back on top for Coinstar. Keep rolling these minus twos. I'm using the most low to die in the game, but like still the game is like, yeah, no, you should roll zeros so you don't get to move and do what you're supposed to do. That's not good. That's not what we need. Hmm. 
this is not good. I needed to move. The reason why I need to move is because Hammer Bro is running a really high chance of getting the star right now. Okay, good. Hammer Bro is walking around. Then it's like fine. But I don't have movement star. And I need the movement star. I should have coins, but I don't have minigame star. I need to get that. If we need a minigame, I can win. Rumble fishing, I should be able to win. There we go. There is no bigger fish than that one. <laughs> I recognize that rumble now. But yeah. Finish. Time situation is stupidly good, actually. The problem is that I'm not sure if we can win. We have been really unlucky with what we roll. Like, extremely unlucky with our rolls. Our luck is like 1 in 27. It's 4% chance to roll at balance we have. 1 in 71. We're currently hitting 1 in 71 bad RNG. No, it's actually not. It's actually worse. Let's see here. 3, 9, 27. 1 in 81 bad RNG. Our RNG right now is 1 in 81. 1 in 81. Like, almost... Almost like a person's flat. Like, that's how bad our RNG has been. So far. Please, Hammer Bro, use your own die. It has 0% chance of giving. Okay, good. This is good. Because it has 0% chance of giving Hammer a good outcome. It's like a 1 in 6 for a non -catastroph catastrophic outcome. So it's like really, really low for anything else. This is not a good minigame, it's a slow one, but I'm fine with this. We're gonna have to win this. Start. Okay, one with one box to spare. Time is looking good, but not as good, but like still really good. This series is sub 30 pace right now. I don't think it will stay like that for long, but yeah. Finally, we don't roll a zero. Yes. 
Finally, we're not rolling a zero. Oh, please don't move the star. I'm gonna be so salty if the star moves now. There's like one place the star can move that's okie dokie. But like, yeah, no. Most star moves are not good right now. Please don't move it. I was super scared there. The star moving right now would be devastating for us because our entire game plan is built around that. Thankfully I'm like first place in coin now because things are going well for us. I think I should have minigame star again. I have slow poke. Oh no, this is bad. Yoshi can actually get a golden pipe here. Okay, Yoshi only got an ally phone. The ally phone is not good that Yoshi got, but it's like better than the golden pipe. The only thing we are scared of right now is people getting golden pipes. That is the only thing that can mess us up this run. If no one gets golden pipes, we are super safe this run. I don't wanna throw. We're not gonna throw this, we're actually gonna win. And I lost because the AI had super A. I have some God's aim. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> cool. yeah. Yes. We tell not getting an ally, but that doesn't really matter. What matters now is... That I can eventually buy the star. I'm hoping to buy it last turn so no one else... No, I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna secure this run. This one is sincerely good enough to super secure. Good enough to super secure. I'm not sure if I need to do that though, but I might. This run is legit world record pace. And I didn't think we would record this this course of all courses, especially not with Wario. But really the Wario is like the slowest character, but if we like keep rolling zeros, like I guess that saves time. I guess. Okay. This one I think we should win. The AI is good at this, but they can't make the AI too good at this because then it feels like heating.
This pace is unbelievable. I'm not gonna hyper secure this run. I'm just gonna secure it. I hope I get the thing for wanting to win as something good. Hammer, bro. Okay, Golden Dash. I think Hammer is the one who fell off, so Golden Dash is a little bit dangerous. But my goal here is that I am not gonna buy the star, but I'm gonna buy the star on the final turn. Because then no one can get the star except for me. I use a normal die, by the way. Because then I can roll a 1, because 1 is the only bad outcome there. And because I can roll a 1, I can actually get an ally, and that is securing my win. <clears throat> I'm curious in a situation where there are no bad outcomes for me. Buying stars next time. Highest probability for rolling at least four is to use the normal die. Or is it? No, hammer die is actually better. It depends. If I need to roll a three, it's better. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have to check here. Yeah, everyone's moving towards the star space now. It was kind of about time people move towards that direction. Can I see my spending space between me and the star? I need to roll a 4 to get a star, so hammer, or the die I just got is better, the, that die. Only bad thing here is like a 1 in 6. There we go. <clears throat> because you should actually buy the star or not. Yeah, I should. I should buy it.
Otherwise, Kuma can get two stars, and that's not good. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. Good. Best place for star spawn. No one can reach that point. As long as Kuma doesn't draw like super high, it should be fine. The problem if Kuma reaches there, though, is that Kuma can see my stars too, and that would be a problem. Even more than a little problem, it would be a quite significant problem. No, wait, that's good. Ha! Oh, this is, this is, this is, this is in my, this is in the bag now. Oh god, it's me. Look at this. There is no longer any bad outcomes for me. I'm winning. The big question now is about if I get a sub 30 or not. And that's a really good question to ask. That is, a, that is a question I like to, like to ask when I speedrun Mario Party. I like to ask the question, can I get a sub 40 or not? Yoshi can actually steal a star from me. Yoshi is actually going for stealing star from me. Yoshi is like going super out of the way just to steal a star from me. That's not good. Am I actually going to have to go and buy another star? Then I can sub 40. If you should steal a star from me, I'm super unfavor to win. Yeah. <sighs> We're so certain Yoshi can't steal the star because this board. What am I even talking about? I'm talking about... Yeah, no, I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I'm gonna take the other star. It might lose me a lot of time, but I'm still, like, gonna be super good for the run. I can't be this greedy. I can't be as greedy as I'm thinking about being right now. I can't be that greedy. Start. I can't be that greedy when I play on Monster. <laughs> We can't be this greedy. That is strictly forbidden. Oh, I was wrong. Finish. <laughs> but yeah, I can't be that greedy. Let's see. How many spaces for Yoshi to reach it? Two spaces, yeah, no. <laughs> There's like one outcome in the entire world can punish me for doing this play. And while I as a seasoned Mario Party player know how likely the one outcome in the world can mess up your run is to happen. That is a risk I am gonna have to take in this situation right now. Here's the thing I was thinking about, like what I was prioritizing. 
I am quite literally sitting on world record pace. Like, I am gonna world record this individual board. And this is not a weak individual board by any stretch of imagination. It's a really strong record. And I was like sitting here being like, eh, should, 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 should I try to save 40 seconds on a run that's like gonna be like super favorite to get the world record in not only this, but like in master altogether? Or should I like be greedy and like play super silly, like greed myself to death? Like, no, I can't, I can't make those decisions here. That's like when I run I individual board alone, I can't think in those terms. Like, I can't think in those terms here. I have like play to win. I, this is like why I'm not happy with running this, because I am gonna have to make plays for winning. I have to play to win. I can't do greedy plays. Like, I'm playing Wario. I'm playing Wario. I move my life splits? Oh no. That was not on purpose. That was an accident. Is it good now? Hmm. I'm super sorry I moved the light split. Thank you for telling me. I am not even touching my mouse, like, I might have nudged it in a weird way. You but yeah, as I said, like, I had to do that play. Now the only thing that can go bad is that Georgia gets a bonus star and I don't, or someone else gets two bonus stars. Yeah. I'm gonna have to fix it better, like, more than two words that I'm right now. But yeah, I cannot do more in the current situation. I might actually not get the individual board record, like, I can't care about that. I already have this individual board record, so, like, I am not too concerned about this. The only thing, like, I'm concerned about right now is winning this board, because I am in a really good position. There's another thing can happen, though. Hambro can actually... Oh, no, if Hambro gets a star here, then it can be over. For real, sis. Oh, for the love of everything sacred, why are we having this bad RNG? Yeah, no, no, Hambro can't win a bonus star. Hamber no, Hambro can't have rich star. I have rich star. Yeah. I must have rich star. <sighs> this is disgusting, though. Now Hambro can't get a bonus star, and I. Like, if Hambro gets a bonus star at all now, I lose, but I don't think Hambro has a bonus star except for Ally, but I share Ally with Hammer, bro. Yeah, no, this is horrible. Why does this keep happening? We are having like the weirdest luck. Yeah, the Yeah no I, I said I talked about this before. This is weird. This is rigged. The master is rigged. It is rigged. Math like Yeah, no, we, we actually got it quick this time. But yeah, Masters is rigged. That is why we have to play as Wario. Like RNG gets rigged in the worst ways in this difficult level. Someone talked about it, but like, yeah, no, it's actually true. I, I was doubting them when I played a little bit. Yeah, it's... Yeah, no, this is bad. We might lose. That would be sad. Which bonus? I hope it goes for me. I hope it. I hope so, because I paid a lot of money. Okay, good, it's mine. So as long as Hamburg doesn't get a bonus star now, we're happy. Lucky. Who has that? I hope it's not Hammer, bro. Okay, it's Yoshi. <laughs> See, if I didn't buy the star, we would have lost now. But yeah, I did the right play in buying the star. There we go, an individual board record.